Pencian Manjir semalam sebab uh, kami tak berada tempat kerja dia kan Lepas tu dia ada satu lagi uh, Siapa agaknya akan hadir yang mungkin pun minat kat sini kena So kita tahu Yuna daripada sana kan LA, Mungkin ada kawan-kawan daripada LA yang uh, Macam masa kan <laughs> uh, Okay first question eh uh, Pencian tentang uh, apa event semalam Alhamdulillah uh, saya dan Adam uh, selamat uh, bernikah semalam jam Jam 6.45 6.45 Kami sebenarnya nak buat earlier tapi uh, delay sikit sebab hujan Di tempat di Pujak Rimba, Bentong Dan uh, uh, apa majlis tersebut dihadiri oleh uh, family and friends yang terdekat Dan uh, Alhamdulillah semua jalan dengan lancar And uh, yelah today kami uh, decided to do a press conference with all of you And esok baru um, main reception uh, with apa, uh, family and friends juga lah and the main ones so disini. semalam uh, I think close friends and family uh, where it was uh, kind of a smaller event apa. and then insyaAllah esok malam tu kita buat macam invite lagi, dapat invite lagi ramai lah yang di sini pun besar boleh like more yeah, and uh, your second question um, ada a few friends uh, uh, Kawan-kawan rapat saya dari US yang datang Beberapa rakan daripada Amerika yang datang Tapi uh, Tak ada lah yang um, Famous ke apa kan Asha tak datang <laughs> Kalau that's what you're asking um, uh, But a few friends yang apa, apa Penyanyi Ada juga datang Seorang tu Gerald Perry uh, And lagi seorang uh, Des Duran Dia merupakan contestant The Voice Lama dah dulu Tapi uh, we've been friends for a long time So dia akan ada esok uh, and um, uh, selain daripada tu uh, saya rasa yang paling famous dekat situ nanti uh, Ashraf dan Bunga <laughs> so yeah. Konsep dia saya nak keep it simple sebab uh, tu kami nak buat memang nature lah kan dekat hutan dekat uh, memang apa area tu bukit tinggi kan? Ya yeah, sebab yeah. location tu Puncak River tu memang cantik uh, so kita rasa pun tak payah nak tambah-tambah banyak dia ada gunung-gunung, ada sungai so everything is a very natural style so kita just Tancat-tancat sikit benda nak complement nature Benda tak fresh flowers kan, tropical flowers so. Tomorrow night, uh, dia surprise sikit Kita, kita keep it a surprise <laughs> Alamak, satu lagi soalan saya Oh, satu lagi, okay, lagi satu Alamak, kakak dengar akan Kita akan teruskan 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 Kita akan Uh, saya banyak ulang alik lah Malaysia dan Los Angeles sebab saya tak nak tinggalkan obviously you know family saya dekat sini um, saya juga ada kerja di sini kan and um, uh, kalau uh, pas kahwin ni kami masih dalam perancangan insyaAllah yeah. boleh sama lah macam ni yeah. kalau boleh ulang alik sebab saya pun dah berapa tahun dah kerja kat sini dan insyaAllah kalau dapat kerja di dua-dua negara tu that's the best plan lah insyaAllah Of course, I want my husband to be with me all the time, kan? Dah. So, <laughs> dah kahwin. So, it would be nice to have him with me all the time. And mungkin in between, sebab Adam merupakan seorang director yang sangat talented. You know, I think he's very talented. Um, and, uh, you know, dalam kerja saya, ada banyak buat music videos, ada banyak buat macam vlogs and all that. So, uh, you know, like, he can help me out a lot lah actually in that sense and walaupun you know saya rasa dia punya talent dan skill melebihi semua tu but maybe that's a start dekat LA ya yeah? yeah. and then I think before this pun Yuna dengan Adam kita jumpa pun kat set shooting and since then the last few years pun uh, kita akan kerja tu sekali ya kerja buat ada commercial, buat kerja video and kita rasa kita ada good uh, working relationship cara kita work together is very Uh, smooth, relaxed and natural so insyaAllah we can continue to work together so I think that's quite good for us 
Adam buat directing, buat filmmaking And Yuna as a talent, as a singer I think it's a good combo Thank you Thank you Alright, terima kasih Soalan seterusnya Okay, I'm Ellie from Jalan uh, Batu Online Hi Hi, Hi. Hi. Okay, uh, My question is I might be wrong but Please correct me if I'm wrong um, Are you guys related Because um, I mean Part Keluarga Maybe No, we're not We're not related not at all. No, not at all Yeah Because <laughs> I did get cheated That you guys are related Somehow related, but it's okay. Oh no, we're not at all related. I think we both uh, have kampungs in Pira, and you know, uh, it as far as it goes. Yeah, maybe um, our aunties know each other from kampung, kan? So yeah, but we're not related. Yeah. So the question is, um, how did you guys meet? Or like, how did you um, for now, uh, everything is still in planning. Um, you know, I have some videos up on YouTube. You know, I tried vlogging before, and um, sebenarnya sangat susah kalau nak buat semua tu sendiri. You know, by myself, because I do a little bit of editing and shooting myself. But uh, you know, we might do that uh, a lot after this, kan? And um, so, yeah, could I be. I think our biggest project was yesterday, and that was another <laughs> successful project. So I think two cara kita work together juga is that sometimes, uh, pernah lah macam time you nak tengah kerja, saya shoot, then saya edit, benda tu dah jadi video. I need to share, you know. So it's very natural way of working. So I think projects are coming gonna come all the time inshallah but uh, next big one next official one I think we're focusing on this one thank you thank you all right terima kasih soalan seterusnya okay there you go hi i'm shayer from new streets times hi shayer uh, first of all congratulations thank you um, going back to yesterday you boleh tak macam menggambarkan sikit perasaan setelah lagi je kabul and then also macam what 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 the atmosphere was like yesterday with all your friends and all that um, it was very beautiful to me, you know, it was everything that I ever imagined, like um, we wanted something small and private and um, also we wanted something obviously very special, you know, and for uh, all my family members and friends to come and enjoy and um, memang, I, you know, that dari dulu I wanted like a garden wedding, tapi macam a lot of people tak setuju kan dengan sebab weather kita <laughs> So a lot of much, uh, my family members also nanti hujan macam mana kan? But you know, yesterday we took a risk. It rained, but alhamdulillah, you know, it stopped. So uh, uh, we managed to you know continue the ceremony uh, about six p.m. and uh, it was very beautiful. I was very happy, you know, like I was obviously you know excited um, and a little bit nervous juga. But uh, alhamdulillah, everything went well. Uh, I think it was so beautiful. Uh, honestly, it's about the, the challenges they tau. I mean, from day one pun, saya pun pernah ikut kereki tempat tu. You can think of all the problems that can happen, eh? In Malaysia, also, you know, weather and everything. But at the same time, I think orang-orang kita and our family as well, when they start hujan, instead of anything negative jadi, all the support was there. From all the supplier, all the family, all the tuan rumah of the area, all the transportation, everyone worked together. And in the end, it came to like, much a lucky feeling they datang ah. Like because much a wow, this is like small to long to do this and make this a beautiful day for us. So uh, I'm so happy. And then I think continue to dinner and all my family is more much very happy. And it was a wonderful day. And inshallah, I can continue lah for uh, tomorrow's event, even today, next weekend, forever. Okay, insyaAllah kan? Okay, terima kasih kepada yang bertanya. Soalan seterusnya? Ayuna, congratulations. Hi, how are you? Thank you so okay, much. Okay, um, uh, soalan klise, apa istimewanya Adam di mata Ayuna and vice versa? Apa istimewanya Adam di mata? Adam, to okay. me. He is... <laughs> snap laju je. Okay. Um, to me, you know, we... 
have a lot in common. Mula-mula, tu the first thing yang I macam notice about us. And then, secondly, I notice dia ni sangat uh, very chill and understanding. He's very positive. And uh, our first day, I'll tell you about our first day, okay? The first day that I, I spent some time with him was at the set. And apa, I just came back from LA for this shoot, this commercial shoot. And then, um, uh, flight to delay tau, actually flight to cancel. So, meaning bila I sampai KL, I terus kena pergi shoot that he was working on. And obviously, I am moody sikit. So, you know, I didn't want to do the shoot. But, you know, when I met him, he made sure that I felt very comfortable. He made sure that I felt very safe and okay, bagi makan dan check on me, you know, like, dah makan, dah minum, are you okay? And the whole day, the shoot went really well because he was very supportive, you know, that, and uh, I think that was the first time that I felt much like, wow, you know, like, uh, I do, I do orang macam ni, kan? And, uh, <laughs> and he was, you know, he was very special lah to me and I think from there on, I done set lah much like, okay, I, I really like this guy. I think because he was very caring and also he has very nice eyes. So. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I think um, on that day as well, sebab kita we set up a very big shoot. We actually shoot at um, Putrajaya and Kerry Studios and it was like this huge set. So cantik. We made all these things to look like a um, very artistic version of Malaysia. So, Macam shoot tu very vital, very critical tau. So we know that in the days leading up to the shoot, that we only have one day to do this sound. It's a very big thing. And then kita tahu that the timing, I think your flight delay. So we know that, okay, Sisi Nauzu is going to come off, she's going to come straight to the airport. So kita tahu yang maybe, you know, dia akan rampi ke apa, which is natural kan. So, you know, I had to prepare myself as an assistant director that dia kerja saya sometimes to jaga talent and make sure they're okay. So I had a much much plan up and up, pull it one and I said they make her feel comfortable. But actually, then the first five ten minutes, kita dah start bercakap bercerita semua about I think it was about horror story or something. Cerita itu. Cerita itu. And then since then, kita <laughs> macam natural lah from there. I pun awak cakap okay, all the plan A B C itu semua boleh buang, cause it's very natural that we can communicate. And I think we shot for another twelve to fourteen hours. And it was a very successful day lah, I think. And uh, since then, Apani, we just kept in contact and a few years down the line, we are here. Here we are, surprise. So, okay. uh, I think just to add, uh, the things that I fear about Papa Ayala Sichiri and Kayuna, which is amazing, is that um, Macam kita buat filmmaking apa semua, semua orang tahu macam klise-klise yang pasal actor-actor, actress yang macam diva ke ni ke apa But for me, I've never met a personality or a talent yang has such a deep heart Macam dia akan terfikir untuk crew, katakan orang dah shoot lambat, penat apa semua She is the type like, okay, don't worry everyone, I'll get this in two takes And pam pam, two takes, she does it really well And we move on, so crew semua pun suka kerja, macam mana crew pun boleh like to work with and that continues throughout her career as well. I think uh, she has a very big heart and a very great mind. She's very talented and is a very lovely lady. Thank you. Wow, that is an amazing story. Thank you so much, Kwadi Ambertanya. All right, next question. Uh, Assalamualaikum, Yuna. Ali dari Utusan Malaysia. Hi. Uh, Yuna, uh, pendekatan semalam uh, mencetuskan, uh, orang kata mengejutkan ramai pihak kerana mereka menyangka Yuna akan melangsikan perkahwinan yang esok. Jadi bila gambar dan berita tentang pendekatan Yuna tu agak mengejutkan. Jadi mungkin ada sebab-sebab mengapa Yuna uh, mengambil keputusan untuk membuat uh, pendekatan secara tertutup dan uh, sepenuhnya tidak berhasil. Terima kasih. Okay, um, okay. so, you know, the reason, um, sebab saya nak adakan pendekatan tertutup. I think uh, apa uh, kawan-kawan Rakyat Media pun tahu I'm very I'm a very private person and you know ini kali pertama eh, saya introduce Adam betul-betul to you all kan and uh, saya tak macam expose sangat hubungan saya dengan Adam kalau orang tanya pun ya kami berkawan apa semua because we don't want to jump the gun and uh, you know and uh, Alhamdulillah semalam we managed to do something that uh, uh, we both wanted you know for for uh, my family and his family and um, I think I'm very open when it comes to kalau dari segi kerja, kerja saya and um, 
uh, but not really my 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 private life, you know. Like I don't really share about my private life. Sikit sikit lah about my family, my parents. Sikit sikit. Um, but when it comes to something very special, like uh, perkahwinan atau pernikahan, you know, I want to keep a little bit of that for myself, you know, because dari memang since dulu saya memang seorang yang very um, private. Bukan secretive, eh. I just want to keep it private, and uh, so tak ada apa. Um, uh, what do you call it? Macam uh, tak ada tak ada uh, distraction ah uh, daripada luar kan? So we can focus. Memang nak buat wedding ni it takes a lot of work from both of us. I think I think uh, as well. Um, yeah. Maybe both of our character in work are pretty very serious. Uh, when you take on some project after so it might just harmony in relationship kita juga and kita maybe you know like to keep it focused this year so throughout these years kita pun tengok macam you know kita dah start kalau dah start having uh, this relationship that it can lead to somewhere you know very special so kita benda tu special jaga kan so at the same time that's why maybe these decisions we do for things a bit more private a bit smaller first so then eventually we can share more and more and more Yes, you know, we go along the way lah. Yeah, kira-kira yesterday was the first time, you know, we went public. Kan macam betul-betul. But you know, wait, the first time, pertunangan lah kan? Awal pertunangan lah. And then, nikah lah. So, yeah. Okay, thank you. Today, we're here with you guys. Yay. Okay, thank you. All right, right there. Um, hi, I have a question over here. This is for Adam. It's a fun question. Hi. Hi, Adam. What's your favorite Yuna song? My favorite Yuna song? Um... <laughs> I mean, I've got like two from like different kind of eras and everything, but uh, I really, really like lullabies. I think uh, lullabies and actually the one song that actually caught me on to everything was uh, Someone Out of Time. Uh, it was once I was uh, hanging out with a friend, a good friend of mine, and he said, Adam, what do you do? I was like, okay, what well, video is this? And then he said, Nia, kau nak ku, Ali, Zadil, Zaba, Ali, Zaba, you know, you know, okay. And then he put it on. And we watched this video straight like four or five times about this simple je. And that's when I know that, oh my god, like this girl just has it up. Where it's just macam dia nyanyi, ada lampu kat belakang macam tu, macam pintu. And then dia close up, close up. And tu je video tu. But it was so, the song, the video, her performance, I think the biggest thing was her performance. So, like for me, like I always look at a singer or artist when they look at camera and so I think you do that very well. Like you can just look at the camera, sikit je, and you're like, oh, you feel engaged. So we listen to that a lot. And that director for that video was, was one of his first videos, Colin Tilly. He's gone on to do amazing videos, Colin Tilly got US and yeah, she met him that day, he's a big hero of mine. But that's I think where it started uh, to really actually Attach someone out of time. And my other question for you guys: I know it, it's hard for you maintaining a career between Malaysia and Kuala Lumpur, um, Malaysia and US. So how will you maintain this, I guess, marriage between Malaysia and US? Um, it's um, you know, it's not going to be easy, but you know, we're willing to take up that challenge. And um, you know, I think we, I don't know, like we've been together for a couple of years. And we managed to, you know, deal with distance. And um, now that I can finally take him to LA, and you know, I could finally like be with him all the time. Um, yeah, I think we're going to be okay. We'll figure it out. I think, yeah. I think the two biggest things to be in a relationship is uh, Skype and WhatsApp call. Because like what five six years ago, when the ni mana, you not make a long distance call. You gonna be cut. You gonna buat ni. You gonna do all this time. So. Um, that has made it easy for us to always have that connection, but that has been the last three years. Inshallah, we want to move forward is to physically be with each other. So uh, I think it's also a challenge on both our parts and maybe also my part to, you know, to see how we can really create and how we can really work in America. So between that. I think for now, um, there will be a time now when we will make a decision, you know, like um, I am planning to stay in LA to work, obviously, you know, because um, that is where I'm based now. And um, but to me, I still have family in Malaysia, you know. To me, I'm also still figuring it out. And uh, obviously, I'm not trying to like 
live in LA forever and ever. You know, at some point I want to come back to Malaysia juga. So we'll see. We'll see macam mana yang tengok. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, terima kasih. Soalan seterusnya. Hi, Ivan Abadi Astro Papa. Uh, hi, I nak tanya, uh, Adam, before this, you kenal tak Yuna? And you tu fikir tak akan uh, berkahwin dengan dia? And then, uh, what's your your new plan after this? Maybe uh, bulan madu and maybe perancangan anak dalam masa dekat atau macam mana? <laughs> uh, okay, I mean before this, kenal Yuna? You mean before today? Kenal. But, but actually before, like, okay, I mean Yuna ever since, I think, you know the rise to start the blank masa tu So, I think when I first heard there was a girl Who wears a hijab, who plays a guitar and sings So, I was like, okay, that's cool, that's very interesting Tapi, like I said, yang I macam maybe tak kasih full focus or attention Until uh, when we saw that video And another thing that I thought of or caught my eyes I think they perform a series Conan O'Brien in America Which was one of my favorite shows so when I saw that, I was like, oh, okay. Now I was starting to get very proud of her uh, as a Malaysian. And I was just sharing that. And I thought the VK any like of this would happen because I didn't know her. But I think when we first met, um, we did meet shortly on one show before, but we met properly on that 12 hours and we had a studio set to be the from each other. It was like 12, 14 hours straight. Like, so I think, okay, 12, 14 hours straight, we tahan lagi, you know, tak ada macam, ah. <laughs> so, I think from there, uh, I knew it was something special. So, that's what all this time relationship has been, is just that Jaga is something special and growing it more and more and more and inshallah, we're still doing the same thing and inshallah, it still will really grow even more after this. Um, children, okay, I am the children question, yeah? <laughs> the children question, I think, you know what, We'll, we'll just let it happen naturally. I think um, um, I am still planning on my new album this year. It will be out, inshallah, by uh, June or July, lepas raya. And uh, lepas tu, I'm going to go on tour. So usually, macam bila dah keluarkan album, I can go on tour. So tour, I can, um, apa, uh, dalam US, and then Europe, and then Asia. So, I don't know, maybe after that, you know, but it's still, you know, um, like I said, we don't want to jump the gun, we want to let it happen naturally and see what happens. Of course, I, I want I want to have kids, I'm very excited to have kids, but, um, uh, kita tengok lah, macam mana. Yeah, like, like I said before, it's another thing to work on and be patient about, and inshallah, uh, yeah. Have a little, you know, Adam one day, but not just yet. <laughs> Alright, they'll be very, very cute though. Alright, thank you so much for your question. Okay, so let's